Hey, hello YouTube. I'm Karan from India, and this video is a little challenge of 10 minutes to create a simple clickable button on the CMD console. So I have created a setup, and the final output should look like this. There should be a button, and which is saying "click me, please." And after on after clicking that, we will change the title of the console. So. I have prepared some setup for you to start easily. So this is the test file here, which is empty right now. So I'm gonna write it right in the batch code to print a simple button layout, which can be clicked. So here's the straw boy worker to Surya. Let's see we can accomplish this task in 10 minutes. So I'm going to start the clock by hitting H. So let's start coding. Prepare the basic setup, and as my all variables are in the files folder, so let me include the path in the path variable. And now, first of all, we need to set the size of the CMD console. So I'm going to make it 80, comma 120. So let me pause it. Let's see what is the output. Oops. It needs debugging. It is quite a large. I think it should be 40. yeah it's the standard CMD size so now what we need to do is we need to create button so we need to call the button function simple button just simply call button function dot bat no need for this just write what you want to show inside the button click, click me please what is this okay then the color of the button should be at zero and let it be a variable let's say button and we don't want the shadow and the console size should be one you will know all of these parameters if you have used button function before I'm writing is quite fast because I know how to use it so let's we have generated the button and saved the code of the button inside this button button variable now we need to print the button using bad box so as the size of the console is 80 column and 25 height so the middle should be according to the width as I am selecting the text Hitting character divided by 2 is 9 so 40 minus 9 should 40 minus 10 is 30 30 comma 9 should be the middle it's, it should not be go to it should be 0 we are shifting the origin and then we are printing the button here so let's see if the button is on the console or not yeah it is a, it's slightly upward so let it put down yeah it seems to be in the center but it's not so let it take it to the center mm, now it's off center also it should be 29 I think uh, I will purchase you after that yeah it seems to be in center but as you can see the button is not clickable it is just a shape we have printed on the CMD now to make button clickable we need to take mouse input so let's create a loop here and what we need to do is we need to check for the mouse input for slash f according to the standards of padbox 
I'm writing all these code standardly. You can get this code from the link in the description below. I'm trying to code as well as talk, so it's quite difficult for me. Let's set the credential for the input let's check with which mouse uh, we are not using the standard button function we are using here which key of the mouse is used to click and x should be percentage a you can see the shortcuts over here almost 4 minutes are over and we are about to get what we are trying to get so let's start by checking if the x position is greater than or equal to the position of the button so x is here is 29 so we know that if x is greater than 29 then it may be the area where we have clicked so let me select this text ctrl c ctrl v and again v so if now we have to check if it is less than the specified area uh, what is the length of the button let me check it it is of 18 characters and we have to add 4 extra because of side borders of the button so it is a 22 29 plus 22 it's quite difficult math I'm not good at math 22 plus 29 51 so we have to write here 51 similarly for the for the y we need to check y starting from 10 so greater than or equal to 10 and the height of the button should be 4 characters so it should be 14 now so let me copy it again and paste it so here should be less than 14 what we are going to see is title clicked just clicked and then we're going to again to the loop at the start of the loop what we will do here we will change the title here after input that the title should be set title should be uh, YouTube tutorial and now we are here setting title to title so I think we have done in 8 minutes let's test it out a title is YouTube tutorial and when I will click we just clicked to change the title to back I need to click on the other location once more otherwise it will not recognize my click you cannot differentiate between the clicks so we have successfully created simple button clicking scenario in, with, in within the CMD console using mouse and this is all you need to know to create your basic CMD button clicking program you can take it to advanced level using mouse edge over and other stuff but this is the basic you need to know for checking the button is clickable or not please comment below if you have any doubt thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel bye bye